SCP-035 is to be contained within a steel, iron, and lead-shielded room at all times. Doors are to be triple locked at all times, with the exception of allowing personnel in or out. No fewer than two armed guards are to be posted at any time. Guards must remain outside at all times, and are not allowed within the containment room under any circumstances. SCP-035 appears to be a white porcelain tragedy mask. A highly corrosive and degenerative viscous liquid constantly seeps from its eye and mouth holes, and anything coming into contact with this substance slowly decays over a period of time, until it has decayed completely into a pool of the original contaminant. The origin of the liquid is unknown. Conversations with SCP-035 have proven to be informative. Researchers have learned details about other SCP objects and history in general, as SCP-035 claims to have been at many momentous events. SCP-035 displays a highly intelligent and charismatic personality, being both amiable and flattering to all those who speak with it. It comes across as highly intelligent and appears to have a photographic memory. However, psychological analysis has revealed SCP-035 to possess a highly manipulative nature, capable of forcing sudden and profound changes to an interviewer's psychological state. SCP-035 has proven to be highly sadistic, and can transform individuals into near-mindless servants with linguistic persuasion alone. SCP-035 has stated that it has intimate knowledge of the workings of the human mind, and implied that it could change anyone's views if given enough time. SCP-035 appears to be a white porcelain comedy mask, although at times, it will change to tragedy. In these events, all existing visual records, such as photographs and video footage, automatically change to reflect its new appearance. Subjects within 1.5 to 2 meters of SCP-035, or in visual contact with it, experience a strong urge to put it on. When SCP-035 is placed on the face of an individual, an alternate brainwave pattern from SCP-035 overlaps that of the original host, effectively snuffing it out and causing brain death to the subject. The bodies of possessed subjects decay at a highly accelerated rate, eventually becoming little more than mummified corpses. Nevertheless, SCP-035 has demonstrated the ability to remain in cognitive control of a body experiencing severe structural damage. Even if the subject's body literally decays to the point where motion is not mechanically possible. SCP-035 is to be kept within a hermetically sealed glass case, no fewer than 10 centimeters thick. A trained psychologist is to remain on site at all times, and research personnel are not to touch SCP-035 at any time. <laughs> 